Well, howdy ho, good neighbor. Today, we're installing fire sprinklers in a sound booth. That's right. When you get your hearing tested, which I should probably take this out so I can hear you, you have a sound booth. There's one, and there's one. And luckily for me, that the hole is already drilled here. So you can see that hole is where I need to put my fire sprinkler. And if you close that door, it is really quiet. Actually, there's two doors, one, two, real thick. So here's what I need to do. I'm gonna, let me unclip you here. And you can see I got a flex drop right there. See that flexible drop? That's what you call a flexible drop. You can move that anywhere. So I'm gonna take that apart and add a T right there. And same with this one over here. I'm gonna take that apart and add a T and hopefully I won't have to hang that one, but we'll see. All right. Let's uh, climb down very carefully. So yeah, that one, See the drops way over there or maybe it's right here so maybe i won't need to let's go in here as you close the door you can see uh it gets pretty quiet in here so there you go can you hear me all right if you can hear me let me close this hopefully there's no lock on it see how quiet it got yeah this is what i need in my house from all the jet planes and look at they have like little terminals there so you can talk to somebody through the wall all right well sound booth installation i'll let you look but you have no ears to see well howdy ho good neighbor yep i'm on top of this sound booth that's where i'm at on top of the sound booth and Here's what I did. I took the 90 off and added a bullhead T. And now I got my laser all laser level, all level both ways. So now I'm just gonna stick in the drop and re-hook up that flexible drop right there. All right, but there's the first step, second step, third step. Okay, there's the money maker just sitting there in the sun shining. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't it beautiful? Isn't everything beautiful? Well, I got the easy one done and I thought I'd show you what it looks like here. I'm gonna climb up on this ladder. <clears throat> and you can see what I did. There's that bullhead T. There's that flexible drop all hooked up again. You can see the head right there. Can you see it? Yeah, you can see it. Let me zoom in for you. Yeah, there's the fire sprinkler head, top and bottom. I could lower it just a little bit, maybe. Maybe, but here's the star of the show. This concealer head. This is what we call a concealer head. You see that? Look at how flush and pretty that is. Yeah, in a sound booth, you. this is a low ceiling, probably seven foot, seven six. So you got the concealer, all right. That should put out a fire in here. No, that will put out a fire in here. Let's be confident. So now we just gotta move all this right over there. And I thought I could just jump across right there and throw my barrel over or my bucket, but it's kind of a big gap. All right, let's get to work. Okay, good neighbor. Like I said, nothing is easy. Of course, this piece is all coming down crooked. So I added a T here and put my swing joint. And then look at uh, this long piece. I had to get an eight foot ladder up here and drill a ceiling flange. It's not wood up there, it's metal. So I had to drill a ceiling flange. There's your hanger, like the way it should look. But yeah, and then of course this T-bar, it landed right on this T-bar. So I did a little bending there. It should be okay, but they're not gonna like it when they put their T-bar in. But I wasn't gonna 90 around it. So yeah, nothing is easy. 
Yeah. And all this water was trapped. So I had to get my valve and plugs. And uh, see that line over there jumps up. So I didn't get any water out of that. Except for the drop. This one was all trapped. So all the water was... And the drain, of course, is way over there on the other side of the building. So yeah, let's go down and take a look what this looks like. Now I gotta caulk the hole with some kind of sound caulking. Ah, always something, but yeah, nothing's easy here. Oh, and then I broke that tile. Getting an eight foot ladder up here. And I bent that, so I gotta straighten that out. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go take a look inside here. That's where all the work was. You can see that long hanger that really, there's a booger. I had to use an eight foot ladder to get up in there. But here is your final product of that fire sprinkler. Looks good to me. Don't look too hard. But yeah, nothing is easy. Let's go turn the water on. Do a little prayer. Oh Lord, save me. And let's get to work. <laughs> 